Next is uh, Norma. Norma's got a problem with a sleeping situation. <laughs> What's happening, Norma? Well, um, so my husband and I, I've been married for five years. We sleep in separate rooms. We started doing this six months ago because when he had the flu, and but then we discovered that we slept better having our own bed. So we just stay with it. And plus I'm a night person and he gets up really early in the morning. We still have great sex life and we still hang out at night. And, but when we have to go to bed, you know, we go to separate rooms. So I was talking to some of my girlfriends and somehow we got into the topic of sleep, right? And so I said something like, and then they just went nuts. And they told me that it was terrible, that it was really bad sign for my marriage. And so do you think that's a problem? I'll put it real simple. You, you're, you said you have a really great sex life. Yeah, we do. You said you get along really well. Yeah, we do. <laughs> um, you, you said you're happily married and yeah. you're both getting a good night's sleep? Yes. Okay, check, 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 check. Yeah. You're fine. <laughs> you're fine. If any of those things start to slip, yeah. then okay, then you gotta sit down, have a conversation okay. with them and say, hey, what's going on? We're not having sex like we used to. We're not spending time together in the evenings. We're going to our rooms, whatever it might be. But other than that, with all due respect to your girlfriends, t tell them to pay attention to their own marriages. Okay. <laughs> You know, okay. keep an eye on what's going on in their house, in their bedroom. The only two people got to be happy with your marriage are you and your husband. Yeah. And it sounds like you're doing great. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you. You have learned one thing from all of this. Stop talking about girlfriend. your relationship to other people. Yeah. Here is the best, the best advice I ever got. When you get married, form a two-handed circle. Mm -hmm. Don't let nobody else in that circle. Because they don't, if you let your mama in, she gonna mess it up. Yeah. You can't let your friends in, they gonna mess it up. Form a two-handed circle, don't let nobody in it. You good. <laughs> hey, we got hey, I'm more. Steve Harvey. You want more of that? Well, don't just sit there. Go get it. Press subscribe or click on this list and you can see all the amazing videos you want. Press it. Press it.